Welcome to the channel. I'm Shadow Scout Swede. Today I'm gonna do a video about my tool bag I bought three days ago. And I haven't opened it yet, but we will do that after this message. Welcome back guys. Let's get into this video, shall we? Here we have the tool bag. Let's open it and see what's inside. I'm always excited when it comes to this type of videos because they are so fun to make. So, nice sturdy handles. And it seems to be a pretty decent quality on this one so let's open it and see what we have it is a lot of velcro on this one and it opens like this but i can open it a little bit more i can open the sides and fold them out so let's see what we have here guys uh, I need to put things together and um, I don't know how this uh, were from the beginning but never mind It looks like this. 95 pieces. We have a nice plier, which is always useful. You always need pliers. You can, you most of the time have too few of them. Oh, there you go. And a wrench. So let's put that in back in. And that was a little bit trickier. And a clamp. You open this like this and so you can hold two pieces together. These are made of um, plastic. I'm not really sure if these will uh, hold up that well, but for smaller stuff, yeah. And these plastic will not feel um, pretty, not that durable, but for small things, they will work. So I have two of them, so that's at least something, but you can uh, change those too. And you have a handle so you can put some bits with different screw uh, bits in this one, which is nice. And uh, you also have hammer a small one but 225 grams for this one but it's not bad it works for small it works for small smaller tasks not not heavy tasks and we also got a three meter measure 
measuring tape. These are awesome. I like these. And you have a nice belt clip. That was really nice and tight fit on this one. So I like this. And I have one extra that I had before. Uh, so I had this one before. This is my older one. Uh, so this is 10 feet for you guys who are not familiar with the metric system. Let's see what we have more. I like, I, I like this. This is awesome actually. Um, and we have a nice little handle. And for that handle, you can put these on. So that is basically a wrench with nice, awesome things. And these are also useful. I have um, used this type pretty often, so these will come in handy as well. And we have also these. I don't know what the English word for these, these are, but these are useful as well. It's not. It's a nice with tools. I love tools. Uh, and why I do I love tools? Because you need them. You can make things. You can fix things. You can repair things. Um, Zip ties, which is really nice. These are um, really long and flat, so not the lot, uh, larger size, but good size for these. So these are always useful. Now I have to put them back too, because I don't want to lose them. That would suck. And when you use use them, you can always put some more in there. And you also have these for that. A screwdriver handle I showed you earlier and these stuck but ah uh, oh, there we go we have these as well uh, the different sizes. Come on camera. So these are nice to have. I hope I can get them back in. Ah, now we come to the next part of it. It's hard, always hard to get things out when you need them, especially when you make a video. Here you have flat screwdrivers and Phillips, so that's nice. 
really nice guys um, yeah different sizes let's see if I can put them back again it's always interesting if you can get them back again it was hard to get them out so I hope I can get them back in um, where they should be let's hope that will okay and you have these small screwdrivers these are made of plastic handles and there are this type with metal handles uh, which are is much better than plastic but this will do um, and uh, this is uh, another one with flat and I have two more of those and I believe these the other two are Phillips yeah yeah, it's a Philips. These are really nice to have, actually. I have those in the metals, but and a smaller one, smaller one. Really nice, really nice. Uh, it's a nice little kit. I I can't say anything about that it's it's really nice kit ah. I almost forgot a scissor that is something I never seen in a toolkit like this before so this is um, yeah it's a decent scissor um, and if you're left-handed or right-handed, doesn't matter because this fit for both. So I will try to cut something with this. And we have actually one more thing in this uh, um, tool bag a nice little box with some screws plugs uh, and uh, other th interesting things here um, nice and when you run out of screws you just fill it up again and and you're ready to go but guys what do I think about A kit like this I paid 300 for this kit what do I say and what do I, is my opinion about it well for that price it's a pretty decent good kit so I'm happy and uh, this is small so you will have the possibility to carry it with you and uh, here's the thing it is good for uh, smaller r repairs uh, when you don't need that much many tools um, 
and you don't want to bring your heavy toolbox to uh, repair something because it's unnecessary, especially when you need uh, a few tools. So, but overall, the bag itself is really awesome. And there you go. Nice, decent, neat little kit. Nice tool bag. Uh, it's made of nylon. It feels like nylon, so it is probably made of nylon. And it's not, It's almost like a handbag in size. And it doesn't weigh that much. So much easier to carry if you have, take with you when you have to do some smaller repairs on a, if you help a friend or anywhere else. So you can have these, this one in, in your car. Doesn't take up much space, so that's really good. And that's all for today's video, guys. Thank you for watching. Thank you for your support. I appreciate it. And if you are new here and have not subscribed yet, please do hit the thumbs up and share this video out. And um, don't forget to ring the notification bell so I you get notified when... I upload new videos and go live. So take care, stay safe, take care, stay safe, be prepared. God bless. Shadow Scott Sweet out.